afternoon, everyone, and welcome. This is Melissa Armo with a stock swoosh, and here we are, 4 o'clock on Thursday, holiday weekend. Hard to believe it, but it does appear that the market is going to make another brand new all-time high in the SPY. Of course, I did predict this. I really am a little bit surprised myself, though, that this is all happening here over the holiday period. Clearly, the market strength came in really the last two days. Today we followed through, but really the day that we gapped down here, reversed this gap down, gapped up then the following day, this was Wednesday, followed through and then gapped up today. I mean, you can't argue with this. In fact, I said to the trading room yesterday, I mean, nobody, nobody in the world now would possibly look at this and think that the market wasn't strong. So the bottom line is that the market is strong. You can't deny it. And we really look like we're setting up to get over this number here I don't know where, I don't know when. Previous high was 248.91. Today's high was 247.77-ish. So not that far away. So the market is closed Monday for Labor Day, open tomorrow morning, and we'll see exactly where we go from here in the month of September. Typically September, people look at it as a bearish time. However, <laughs> it doesn't, doesn't appear to be <laughs> happening at the moment. Uh, I don't really see a lot of red here. <laughs> so what I see is strength. What I see is buying. It's clear to everyone is day. And it's a strong market. So whatever the reasons, you can look at what's happening in the world. You can look at all the things around you. You can talk, talk, talk. But the market is having a very, very positive year in 2017. So market is strong. We'll see where we go from here. Again, that previous high has never been this close, and we're ready up over the pivot back here from the 16th. You know, we had this gap down. I just want to quickly review this. We had this gap down that happened on the 17th, and, and I was aware of it. I noticed it. We had a power trend day down on that day, and we gapped down the following day too, but right after that, we held. So we really did not have any follow through, okay? We didn't follow through on the selling action, is what I'm trying to say, okay? So do you see here, we had no follow through on the selling action. We're having follow through on the buying action. So this is strength. This was weak for a day, but it put, pittered out. Didn't really follow through. You see the difference here, okay? So it's a big difference to me. So we'll see where we go the first week of September out of the gate. If I have time, I will do a review tomorrow to see how we close before the holiday weekend. But sun is shining in the spy today and this week to close out the end of August. And we'll see what we get uh, between now and the end of the calendar year 2017. Have a great Labor Day weekend, everyone. And if you have any questions or want to sign up for the Golden Gap course, email me at melissa at thestockswoosh.com. Thanks, everybody. Have a great day.